In a judgment published on Thursday, the European Court of Justice ruled that consumers may demand compensation from banks beyond the reimbursement of monthly instalments paid if a mortgage contract with unfair terms is declared invalid. The tribunal added that, by contrast, it precludes the bank from relying on similar claims against consumers. Case reference C520-21 concerned remuneration for the use of capital after the cancellation of a Swiss franc loan agreement and was brought up by a Polish court questioning the ECJ about this matter. On the one hand, the question was whether banks could demand from the consumer any other benefits apart from the return of the capital and the payment of statutory interest for delay from the time of the request for payment and, on the other hand, whether banks could pursue claims that go beyond the reimbursement of monetary benefits. The ruling, although widely expected, is a blow to the Polish banking sector and ends the bank's practice of demanding use of capital payments from foreign exchange borrowers who have won court cases against them. A large number of customers have been able to win such cases owing to the lender's use of abusive clauses in their foreign exchange mortgage agreements with consumers. Although Polish banks ceased to offer foreign exchange denominated mortgages in 2012, the outstanding loans of around 130 billion złoty still pose a risk to the Polish banking sector as consumers sue banks for damages in courts. Most foreign exchange loans were denominated in Swiss francs when the Polish national currency was strong, but later on the franc appreciated rapidly, leaving consumers with extensive debts to pay off.